Geschäft und right below that uh, bottom grip is wider than the other two putters. So it was tough to get on there, but it still fits. If you can see that, yeah, you can see that. Still fits. Let's see this guy in action. Okay. Get off there. And aim in for the one on the left now. Okay. Aim in for the one in the middle. I touched it. That means it's going to be good. Set myself. Aiming for the one in the middle. Uh, hey, look at that. Gotta love carpet putting. All right, number four. This will be number five. Aiming for that one in the middle. That's way off. So now, I guess we can check our progress. This is upside down to you, but right side up to me. No. Actually, it is right side up to you. So you should be able to see that. Coming around to see my own stats with you. Ha ha, hi. Okay, so it's telling me I have a 8.6 closing strong arc Impact angle is an average of 4.3. Tempo, 1.5 to 1. That's pretty good, the tempo. So, but they were all closed. So now, uh, essentially, if you were to do this, you know, multiple times. You can then go to this area here to compare. Being that I've only done, uh, huh, apparently I have a 6.2 putting handicap, 16.2. It's pretty accurate actually. Okay. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope this, uh, explained the uh, iPing putter app with the cradle pretty well. Again, there's how it attaches to the side of a uh, long putter. And again, you calibrate, when you calibrate your user, you click on the putting uh, icon on the lower left, and you can calibrate left-handed and long or straight, uh, standard rather. So, I hope that video helped, and if you get this little unit, hope it'll help you lower your scores. Uh, until the next video,
I'll continue putting as I do. Ooh, got it. Gotta use it when you're carpet putting. Gotta use the, uh, gotta know your carpet. All right. Until next time, I'll catch you in the next video. Later. <laughs>